How's it going everyone and hope you're doing well. Today these are right. The Adidas Predator, uh, the new lines, Accuracy Plus, FG versions, got them in the UK 10s, uh, European 44 and 2 thirds, and in US 10 and a half, Japan 285, and in Chinese size 275. Whoosh. These are very, very nice and I've had a look at them and in my opinion they are better than the Predator edges, much much better, uh, lighter and a better in terms of the touch control materials at the front. But yeah, let's take a look. Whoosh, look at that, look at this beauty. It has the old school look but also the modern Predator looks too, a nice little combo. Nice and soft heel cushion at the back. Midfoot, I can definitely feel a very wide surface area, which is good, as it will fit wide feet players as well, and very wide feet. Um, a nice soft toe box area but also has a thicker material to, to protect you from being stepped on and studded. So a nice and soft material, but not too soft, and it offers good protection at the front. Here, it also shows high definition grip. Now, as I said in the beginning, last year's, um, not last year's edges, but the previous one before, um, these touch controls and the grip was very high up and as you wore onto the boot what happened was it would wear out and it would not be as long lasting. These seem a bit smaller and tinier so there's a big of a difference there but I don't know in terms of durability wise probably if you use it for a half season to one season they too will wear out and the definition grip will not be as effective as when you first have them. What I like about this side is it also has a very nice little control area here for your what I say side foot to help you control the ball. Again this feels like a feels like it's been stuck on like a bit of a sticker and again with long-term use it probably will wear off um, from both sides. Nice Adidas logo that they've done at the back here. And very soft, look, you can see the material here. It's very soft, so it allows you to slip on your foot for you to put your foot into the boot very easily. And if you do struggle, I'm sure like all the Predator lines, yes they do have. We'll have a look at the boot bag first. This is a boot bag. Very cool design. Very simple as well. Adidas logo. Recycling materials. The usual leaflet you get with Adidas boots. And of course, with the Predators, they always give you the heel clipper. So if, if you do struggle to put on the boot, maybe if you've decided to go a half size down, you can use this to help you put your foot into the boot. But usually with Predators, you won't really need to, even with the Plus versions. They are very nice and wide and soft material here and at the back for you to put your boot in. So overall, in terms of first thoughts and initial opinion, very nice boot, very nice design. They've kept the sole plate here, look, very similar to the edge. Still got a little diamond crest at the front. Um, what's that? Face frame? But yeah, this is a very nice design. I, in my opinion, I prefer it over the edges. Um, but it's still got that wide surface area like the edge. So it's very nice touch. But yeah, very nice design boots and very good. And leave a comment down below if you do have these as well, what you think of them, if you like them, if you dislike them, um, what's good and bad. So it helps people out that want to get these boots 
for the future um, to help them out in making a decision whether to buy these or to go for a low cut versions with the laces or to go for the point ones. Um, yeah, so help them out majorly. And when the point threes and point twos and point fours come out, I'll also do an unboxing on those. So thank you very much for watching this unboxing and first thoughts of these boots as soon as I've got them. And please make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time for another boot review, unboxing, playtest and football content all around. All the very best and take care.